Hi guys, so I've got a shopping haul to show you. Mum and I went to Cambridge today. We went to a shop called Kitchen and Things. Um, I'll show you what I got in there. Apparently it's not a pop-up, it was near the Grafton Centre. It was really good and quite cheap. Primark. Where did we go? Um, the market. A shop called Ark, but I don't think I bought anything in there. A shop called Podrock, didn't buy anything in there. Typo, I got something in there in their sale. Flying Tiger and Paper Chase and Poundland. Um, if I have the receipt, I'll show you the prices kind of up here or here somewhere. If I don't, then sorry. Um, just to point out, this is from Tiger, this massive bag. It was a pound. It saved my life because Primark bag was going to break on me. <laughs> right, I will start with Poundland because I only got two items in there and they're at my disposal. I got a four pack of Hello Panda. They're Ethan's favourite. They are, if I could find, I think they're like 35 grams each. Oh, it says it on the front. 25 grams. They're normally like a pound in more like supermarkets or places like that. Got four packs, obviously a pound. And what else did I get in Poundland? I got these. Mini hands. I've wanted a pair. I'll make a sort of choice. Um, sorry, I had to get that out of my system. I've wanted a pair for ages. Um, online there, four or five quid. I don't know why I want a pair, I just want a pair. They're the latest thing on TikTok. I just thought they were quite cute. Um, yeah, just a pound. Just a bit of fun. I'm sure I can play around with them um, in some videos. That's pretty much all I've got in Poundland. Oh, and a drink. So, nothing exciting. But yeah, so, I'll stop being so noisy in a minute, I promise. That is Poundland them down there sorry you got a forehead shot then right then I will show you what I've got in typo so all the Christmas decorations were reduced the big 10 pound baubles were a fiver and the smaller ones which I think were three pounds something like that they were all a pound I found that I found that in most shops today that either they were reduced or really cheap I wanted this last year and didn't get it the original price on it is three pounds and I got it for a pound it's really heavy as well I just thought it was really cute um, to go on my Christmas tree and I got these for mum I know she doesn't watch my videos so that's okay I'd rather be at home with my dog just a pack of tissues 50p just thought they could go in a little present for her so that's typo um, where else did I spend money today? I spent money in paper chase, but I can't think what on. Does my face look really confused because I feel really confused? I got these two items in paper chase, but I know I got something else as well. Oh, here it is. So Ethan's favourite animal is penguins, so I got him this little pen. It says £3.50, but I'm pretty sure it was 50% off. Oh, turn around. Really cute. Apparently its name is Pip. Pip the penguin. So I got that for a stocking. I got this as well. It's a mystery bag. It was meant to be £5. It was obviously 50% off. It's £2.50. You can get Boo, Sweetie, Ed, who is limited edition, who I actually really wanted. Mimi, which if you don't know, that's my nickname. Um, Chi Chi and Pip. And I got, which is literally, you couldn't write it, it's unbelievable. Mimi. So Mimi for Mimi. I just thought it was really cute. I think it's an apple on its head. But yeah, really soft. So that's mine. Simple as that. Nobody else is having it. That's mine. And I got a postcard saying everything will be okay. I think it was like 80p, something like that. I'm not sure. Right, so that's Typo, Poundland, and Paper Chase done. So I've got that 
kitchen and things shop to show you Tiger and Primark so I'll show you that kitchen and things it was by Grafton Centre I don't think they've got a website it was just like an Aladdin's cave of baskets and stuff like I could have spent so much money in there if I wasn't close to shopping today I would have spent a lot more so I got this it says Covent Garden it's metal I got it for a pound I just thought it was cute it's got no holes in the bottom so I can't use it for the garden but I just thought it was cute I got this for mum for Boxing Day. Boxing Day we do a single present each or a couple of presents depending on who's there. Less than five pounds. So I got her this barn star, metal, three pounds. Like for just for, right, so you can tell how big it is. It's just cute. I actually wanted one myself, but um, I resisted. And then I needed a main present for mum and she pointed out she liked this so we agreed I'd buy it for her, it's £4. She wants it to put her wool in because she does a lot of knitting. Really cute pattern, they had loads of different patterns, loads of different sizes and the guy in there actually gave mum a discount on what she was buying. It was just like being on a market store, the guy was just bartering with us. Um, really really nice, it's called Kitchen and Things, I will try and find a website for them if possible if I can then look for it on my blog because I actually really like that shop and there was an awful lot I wanted in it and yeah the guy said they'll still be there after Christmas so as long as we're not in the lockdown again I may go back to Cambridge and film because I just want so much that stuff so that's kitchen and things which I can't say normally um, so I will move on to Tiger and I have a feeling Lily is about to make an appearance because she is getting very close to me so sorry if you get a cat on the screen in a minute right tiger i got these well i think they're adult sizes but i'm probably going to give them to ethan they're like a little santa claus i think they were a pound i uh, got this not for anybody's present but just because i liked it it was two pounds cute little box i'll probably store christmas decorations in it if i'm honest got these lollies for Ethan's stocking um, or just for presents two for a pound they're little Santas yeah they're little Santas you can't quite see the camera won't focus but they're little Santas just trust me on that got this one for a pound also for Ethan's stocking we've got a burger one of these somewhere and Ethan loves it so it was just cute if you notice there's a thing of pens and I don't really know why got this music box for him I actually don't know how much this was I will put the price up if I can find it can't imagine it was any more than three quid though I got jingle bells so are you ready can't keep a straight face whilst I'm doing it, sorry. Ethan got a Rewill Walk You one of these last year and he absolutely loved it, so I got him another one. I got this, I'm pretty sure it was a pound, it might have been two pound. Little snow globe, it's got Santa with his presents. I always get Ethan a snow globe, I don't really know why. It started off as just a passing thing that I'd buy for him and it's kind of started into a tradition got these for a pound they're tea lights but I actually don't think I want to melt them because they're really cute um, a pound for three not a pound each got one of these for Ethan I always get him one it was two pound it keeps him really busy like really busy you can get all different ones on the side I really wish this would focus it's annoying me now anyway yeah um, anything else on Tiger? Oh, and I got this because everyone at work keeps saying I'm spoiled sport for not joining in, and it was a pound. So that can just stay on for the rest of the video now. Because why not? Okay, so I've got Primark left to show you. Um, so yeah, I will crack on with that, but I have to be back right in two seconds because Lily is about to knock over. Okay, so I managed to rescue everything from being attacked by Lily. Yeah, so these are now going to stay on. It was a pound. Bit of fun. Um, 
before going to Primark, I went into this shop. I've never seen it before. It was called Mini Mini So Life, a Japanese or Chinese shop. Um, just by Red Line Yard, if you know Cambridge well. It was really cute. Again, I could have bought an awful lot in there. But um, I got this little fella for £2 just because it was cute. Not for any present or anything, just to go on the tree. And they had big soft toy penguins as well that were really cute. Right, Primark. Grown up socks because I thought they were cute and I always need more socks. They were £1.50, just popcorn. Got some cards. Ethan's already written his for school this year, but these are too cute to turn down and they were at the till. They're a pound, they've got that design and a different one. Uh, trying to think where to put things. I'll put that there. Um, thong, pound, don't need to see that. Ethan's got real problems licking his lips at the minute below and above. So I managed to pick up some Carex, 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 Carmex. Where was I getting Carex from? Carmex. Um, it was two pounds. I'm pretty sure that's the same price it is in the supermarkets, isn't it? Or Superdrug or any other brand named Health and Beauty Shop. Got some of these from my Secret Santa. They're two pounds. They are super soft. I kind of want to keep them for myself, but yes, they're for my Secret Santa. Some scrunchies because if you see my previous shopping hauls, I always pick up some scrunchies, and these are in super cute colours. They're two pounds, and they actually seem to have. Um, quite a good stretch on them they're from um, autumn winter 20 so I'm guessing they'll be in the shop for a little while yet got a nice underwear set because we know every time I go to Primark I always end up buying some nice underwear £5 bralette set here's some nice little knickers because who doesn't love new underwear also running out of space to put things because I don't want to make too much noise for the microphone because we learned the lesson last time what happens when I do that this was four pounds it says make your happiness a priority can't quite show it yeah four pounds just thought it was really nice it feels really nice as well got Ethan oh I've knocked off my Santa legs got Ethan some chocolates for his stocking 100 grams I think they were a pound there's Santas and well Red Bulls in there I, I don't know how to say that about it sounding wrong got Ethan some Tic Tacs for his stocking as well I feel like I bought loads of things for his stocking today but then I think when I put them in his stocking they're not going to see that many I think they were a pound Tic Tac mixes cherry to cola Ethan's obsessed with Tic Tacs so if you know of any strange flavours or anything that you can get, um, let me know. And I will sort out trying to buy some from you with a postage and that for him. Because he would love that. I got myself this. It's called a body. It was £12. Really bad light to try and show you. It's like a blue colour. Um, I just thought it was nice actually. For no real reason. I just thought it was nice. You know, maybe I'll have one one day to show someone maybe I'll have someone to show one day and then the last thing I bought in Primark was my dad's Christmas present a nice well I say red but it's not red it looked red in the store what colour do they say it is burgundy um, shirt try and get a good light on it but it's not really happening tonight well it is nearly 10 o'clock at night so I'm guessing that's why um, it was £8 so burgundy shirt so yeah I spent far too much money today but it was really nice to get out and actually be almost normal in Covid times to be honest um, and YouTube hates that word so well done Megan but yeah I think I'm pretty much sorted for Christmas I've got a few more bits these are doing my head in and um, oh god wearing them for a nine hour shift tomorrow is going to be fun yeah I've got a few more little bits to get here and there but I actually am quite impressed with my haul today yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed that and it wasn't too boring i'm sorry it's based on my sofa but as i said it's nearly 10 o'clock at night i just wanted to get the shopping away but i thought i would do it quickly and film it yeah i can't obviously upload this until nearer christmas because otherwise ethan will see it so i hope if i don't speak to you guys soon 
or sooner than English number one, as Jackie would say from Nerdy Crafter. If I don't speak to you guys before, I hope you guys have a lovely Christmas. And there hopefully will be more videos in the new year when we've got a bit more time to ourselves. But yeah, I will see you soon guys. Bye.